Tristan Hell, you need no introduction. Welcome back to the Cowboys. I know you're excited. Uh, did you kind of have a feeling you'd end up here? Uh, a little bit, yes, ma'am. You know, I, I have my, I have my hunch. You know, I'm, I'm just excited to be here. And then, you know, obviously, you know, coming to the Dallas Cowboys and you know, um, going to the team that I want to go to and having the opportunity to play is huge. Tell me about your feelings throughout the draft, and we'll get to Rod Marinelli in a second. First of all, your feelings just going into the whole thing on day two. Right. Um, you know, they, they were a little bit all over the place. Um, you know, I, you know, obviously with me, you know, having like my, I'm huge in my faith and stuff like that. I had, I had, you know, I had a good feeling about everything. And, you know, there's nothing like, you know, you can't prepare for when that phone call comes through. So, uh, you know, it was a little bit, I was shaking a little bit, but it was definitely worth it. Your relationship with Rod Marinelli, it's been going for a long time now. You spent your birthday together. He worked you out. Yeah. Why is this such a strong connection? You know, I think that, you know, with me and with his and I relationship, you know, it just I can tell that he wants me to be the best and, and I want to be the best for him. And, you know, when we were there for my birthday and we were sitting in the hotel lobby and he was talking to me, he was like, man, you here for your birthday and everything like that. And I'm asking him, coach, you know, what am I going to do for drills, this and that? And, you know, he sat there and told me, you know, don't worry about it. You know, just just do what you do and, and you're going to do fine. You know, uh, that reassurance that he has, you know, um, you know, just being around him, having his energy around me, it, it, it's the best feeling. It's obvious that he has given you that reassurance coaching staff loves you what do you have to say about maybe some rumors or things that were going around about college and your attitude and being right, young and right. this and that I think I think that a lot of that's you know was fueled by you know nothing really I don't, I don't know where that really came from you know there was questions about me not starting but you know that they, they, UCF you know we compete every day you know there, there's a great depth there and you know I'm just excited to, to be here I know the coaches feel comfortable with me and I'm happy to be here playing that defense with the star on the side of my helmet and coach aside, what excites you about this defensive line? I don't know. I think lining up next to, uh, to, to Demarcus Lawrence is pretty cool. You know, I think that's cool. Uh, Jalen, all those boys, you know, being in the locker room with uh, with Zach and Deke and them, you know, just, just being around those guys and, 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 you know, it's a dream, you know, and, and me being able to sit here and, and sit here and, like, say that I'm going to be in that locker room and be around those guys and working with those guys, and you know, it's speechless. I, I can't imagine. I don't have the words to really express it. Well, welcome to Dallas. You're here. It is real. Congratulations. Yeah, it is real. Thank you. Thank you for having me.